And so, for Mary, her darkness has turned to light. She experiences the fresh revelation of the risen Christ. It is one of the most amazing stories found in the Gospels concerning the resurrection of Jesus. And it's a wonderful story and we could rejoice just over that. I mean, that's enough reason to praise him. Yeah, let me try it one more time. I said that's enough reason to praise him. Uh, the fact that he rose from the dead with all power in his hand is a, enough reason to praise him. The fact that he defeated death, hell, and the grave is enough reason to pray. I don't care what's going on in your life. You got a reason to praise him because you serve a risen Savior. He's in the world today. I know that he is living whatever men may say. I hear his voice of mercy. I hear his voice of cheer. And just the time I need him, the songwriter said, he's always near. Why? Because the chorus echoes, he lives, he lives, Christ Jesus lives today. He walks with me, he talks with me, along life's narrow way, he lives, he lives salvation to continually impart. You ask me how I know he lives. He lives. He lives. He lives. Say, Casa, he lives. Anybody know he lives in here? Anybody have a witness? Do I have a testimony in this house? He lives. He lives. He lives. Not just seated at the right hand of the Father, but he lives in my heart and your heart by the power of the Holy Ghost. Today, we could rejoice over that, but I want to give you one more reason to rejoice. I want to give you one more reality. I want to give you one more perception that is not clouded by the darkness. For I know that there are people under the sound of my voice this morning. I, I know that there are people here this morning who are going through your own dark night of the soul. It may be bright outside, but inside the darkness of your situation and your condition is causing you not to be able to see the reality. And your perception is skewed because of the darkness. And you cannot see that he stands in front of you this morning. You cannot see that the risen Christ is risen. risen. You cannot see this morning that there's an answer. You cannot see this morning that there is hope. You cannot see this morning that there's a reason for joy in the midst of your sorrow. You cannot understand right now because you're in the midst of the nighttime hour. You're in the midst of the morning. You're in the midst of, of the moaning and the whining and complaining. You're in the midst of your difficulty and your circumstance and your disturbance and your depression and you're in the midst of your own darkness but the Bible says that weeping endures for a night but joy come in the morning I came to tell you this morning that there's a reason to rejoice you may be in a dark time but joy is yours you may be in a darkened condition but he's risen you may be in a bad place in a bad situation but I came to tell you that the master of the wind and the wave the master of the sea the master of the universe the creator of everything that lives the one who stood on nothing and created everything he is alive <laughs>